Sumatlet.com delivers the best online shopping experience. With an extensive selection and the lowest prices, you're guaranteed to find the product you need. Here's what you get. Free shipping on all orders over $49. Free one to two day shipping on all orders over $99. All orders placed by 6 p.m. ship out the same day. Shop at Sumatlet.com, the web's most popular swim shop. Today in the Finice Monitor is Tyler Fenwick, who joins us from Mission Viejo, California. Hi, Tyler. How are you doing today? Jeff, I'm doing great. A little disappointed headed into work. I saw a cloud out in the sky. Well, you know, it's it's we never have we never have clouds in the sky here in Phoenix, <laughs> but you know, when it's 111, it kind of you know takes away from that. I hear you. So I understand you got some big news to share. Tell us about it. I do. I um. I've been uh, officially hired uh, by Matt Kredich at the University of Tennessee, so um, I'll be taking over as associate coach starting uh, the beginning of July. I'll be headed straight from U.S. Olympic trials to uh, to Knoxville. Wow, that's uh, no, not even a, a da any downtime for you there. Yeah, it's um, I, I got right to it. There's uh, there's a lot of work to be done, but I'm I'm pumped. It's uh, it's kind of a homecoming for me, so I'm uh, I'm really excited. Yeah, so I can't imagine that was an easy decision to make because I know you were really excited about your work there at Mission Viejo, the this, the the improvements you've been making with your team there. Absolutely, it's um, being able to work at Mission Viejo has been a dream come true. Um, the opportunity to work with the men's national team and work with a group of athletes I have has been absolutely fantastic. But, um, you know, after meeting with Coach Rose and meeting with Coach Schulberg, um, it's they, they pretty much told me this is this is a once in a life opportunity and I've got to take advantage of it. And, and where I'm going to miss Mission Viejo, I, I can't tell you how supportive they've been and that, that makes this so much easier for me. Yeah, and you're 31 years old. I mean, a lot of coaches your age would be just chomping at the bit to be able to take this. So I think if you'd said no, I, I think a lot of uh, coaches your age would be uh, kind of screaming at you right now. <laughs> Absolutely. I think I would have taken a lot of flack. So obviously the, the, the lure of being an associate coach at, at a major university like Tennessee was a, a factor in this decision, but what specifically convinced you that this would be a good move for you? You know, I, I think, especially on the men's side, we, we, we kind of have a, a clean slate right now. And, and we, it's, there's a whole lot of opportunity there to take this program um, and turn it into a powerhouse and, and, and make this one of the programs in the country that the top student athletes want to go to. And I, I think the chance to be able to work with Ashley, athletes on the national and international level um, at the on the NCAA stage it was really attractive to me and as you said earlier it's gonna be a homecoming and let people know you you previously coached there with credit on the women's team yeah I was uh, Matt's graduate assistant and I also worked with the um, with the pro group with Tennessee Aquatics so I worked with Christine Magnuson and I was uh, primary coach for Data Starwater and so um, I had some great times in Knoxville so you're going back to Knoxville. Is there anything that you that's kind of you know that's changed since you were last there? Oh my goodness, Jeff! I um I flew in for an interview about two weeks ago, and um I could not believe the campus. How much it's changed. It's totally being rebuilt. The um especially on the athletic side, the facilities that they're putting up right now are are. Really second to none. I've had an opportunity to travel to most of the major universities in the U.S. and Tennessee is making a push to be right up there with with any of them. We've got um, three 50 meter pools right now, two uh, two indoor, a uh, 30 million dollar brand new facility, and then an outdoor 50 meter pool. They're building a brand new 30 million dollar weight room. Um, it's it's unbelievable. Three 50 meter pools. That's that's it. It's um it's I thought it was a luxury to have one fifty meter pool, but um now we'll have uh I'll have three at my disposal. Well I I'll say that that's gotta be uh gonna be a big recruiting tool for you when you start recruiting. Absolutely. I, I can't wait um to have the chance to bring kids in and, and show off the campus a bit. 
it's um, it's it's going to be fun. What's the goal for Tennessee, let's say four years from now, not just for the women's team, which is already doing so well, but the men's team as well? Yeah, Matt's done a fantastic job um, with the women's team. But, um, you know, four years from now, we, we'd like to be competing in, 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 the, in the talk for NCAA championships. And I think that that's any goal. At the same time, um, I think that any great program – isn't just going to focus on NCAA results, but but also U.S. national results. We want to be putting um, young men in finals at U.S. nationals. We want to be putting young men on international teams for the U.S. And that's um, that's something that's very important to me. Speaking of uh, kids on national teams, you've got a couple of, not just a couple, more than a couple of kids <laughs> there at Mission Viejo who will be watching it at trials, I would imagine um, it's going to be pretty emotional watching them at, at trials, knowing it's going to be your final time working with them. Absolutely. Um, my, my, my boys have been tremendous. They, um, they inspire me every day. They're, um, they're, they're just fired up to work, and um, they're great kids. In the, in the pool, out of the pool, um, they're fantastic in, in the classroom, and um, yeah, I've been I've been through a lot with them. I've I've had them since they were babies, and um, it it will be emotional. You're gonna give uh, those guys at Tennessee the same kind of set you gave at Mission Viejo, hundred <laughs> hundred hundreds on one ten, I think it was. I'm gonna be a little more restricted at Tennessee. I've um, I've, I've I've got about 20 hours a week to work with. Here I've got endless hours a week to work with. So I'm gonna have to um, gonna have to tone it down a bit, but um, I promise you they will uh, they will be working. Maybe just fifty one hundred on one ten. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll we'll see what we can do or maybe we'll, we'll put them on 05, save some time. <laughs> I like that idea. Uh, <laughs> final question, what do you think is the difference will be the difference for you coaching college swimmers as opposed to age group swimmers? And it, besides the time that you have? Sure. I, I think that the, the one thing that you have in a, in a college environment is, is you know, parents are, are sending us their, their kids, and I'm, I'm going to be responsible for them for four years. And so it's, um, I've, I've got to play more of a role in their lives um, in terms of school um, and making sure they're keeping up with their studies, making sure that they have the support they need to excel in the classroom. I need to make sure they're eating right. I need to make sure that they're, they're taking care of themselves and, and that I'm putting them in the best position to be successful. College is, is where you, you, you start to become an adult. And um, I'm, I'm going to have a major hand in that process. And I take that responsibility seriously. It's important. Well, Tyler, I think it's, I think it's going to be a responsibility you handle well. We've seen you on deck doing real well with the kids at Mission Viejo. I can't imagine it's going to be a difficult transition for you. I appreciate it, Jeff. All right. Congratulations. We'll see you at trials and um, on the deck later at Tennessee. Sounds good. I'll talk to you. All right. That's Tyler Fenwick joining us in the Phoenix Monitor. Going to be heading off, heading back to Knoxville in a few in a few weeks. I'm Jeff Cummings. Thanks for watching.